Hi there, it's Clay with ModernLove.Life, and this is Relationship Inner Game. Now, this is another video in our series on very common uh, things that people experience in the process of getting back together with their ex, and how you can go ahead and overcome these sorts of things. Uh, specifically, in this video, we're going to be talking about how to apologize to your ex, or how to get your ex to forgive you. Now, before we go ahead and get into all of this, let's kind of get a a little bit of background uh, experience about what you might be experiencing when it comes to apologizing with your ex, right? So oftentimes, if you have gone through a breakup with your ex, you might have already tried apologizing to them. You already may have tried promising that things are going to be different, but maybe they're not taking it. Maybe they say, I can't believe you. Maybe they say, I wish you would have said that a month ago, two months ago, three months ago, a year ago, whatever. What is going on here is that your ex is acting in a way where they are behaving with consistency towards their previous actions, right? So they've already gone through the process of breaking up with you. They've already mentally made that uh, decision in their mind and then they went ahead and they broke up with you. And uh, so they've already convinced themselves that they are better off without you than they are with you. So if you just simply apologize to them, if you simply just say, hey, I'm sorry, hey, let's give this another shot, hey, take me back, please, they are going to be a little bit skeptical of that and they're going to be a little bit resistant of that, okay? And oftentimes when people do this sort of apology, what happens is they don't even really necessarily know what they're apologizing for. And even if they do know what they're apologizing for, they're not saying it in a way where their ex is actually going to take it and uh, really soak it in and accept it and be able to move forward past, you know, whatever may warrant the apology. However, before we go ahead and get into how to apologize to your ex, let's just talk about if you even need to, first of all. Oftentimes, when we work with people, uh, they are looking for something to do to get back together with their ex, right? They're looking for something that they can say, something that they can send to them, something that they can text to them, or something that's just going to kind of get things moving. And they will often take some of our advice when it comes to apologizing to their ex and use it because they think, well, hey, you know, I'm not back to with my ex, I might as well apologize. But I'm here to tell you today that you may not need to apologize to your ex if you genuinely don't think that you did anything wrong. If you genuinely don't think that you did anything wrong, then there is no need to apologize to your ex because, number one, you don't know what you're apologizing for. And number two, even if you did apologize for something, it wouldn't come across as very authentic. It would come across as hollow, as forced, as just kind of going through the motions, hoping to, uh, you know, iron over this disagreement that the two of you are having so that you can get back to the status quo, right? And that is not going to convince your ex to want to work together with you to put the past behind the two of you so that the two of you can have a new beginning together. With that being said, how do you go about apologizing to your ex? How do you get your ex to forgive you? And the answer to that is that you have to really connect your actions that upset your ex, that uh, caused your ex to feel a lot of hurt or um, pain in some respect, and you have to connect those with how it impacted them and how it made them feel. You have to really own what happened and you have to uh, own your part in it and you have to kind of imagine what your impact on them may have been. This is where empathy really comes into play. This is where some of those advanced relational skills really come into play. You have to be able to uh, project a little bit um, onto your ex what you think their experience might have been. And you have to take that in and you have to reflect that back to them. And if you can do this in a way that allows them to, to understand and to really get that you had an impact on them that you did not want, that you regret, that if you could, you would do over again, that can start to help them let go of the pain, of the hurt, of the, of the bad feelings that they're holding onto, that they're uh, maybe, maybe suffering with right now and holding against you. And it will allow them to start to put those behind them, okay? Because first of all, you really have to apologize to your ex if 
something that you did genuinely hurt them, okay? Otherwise, no amount of advanced relational skills, no amount of trying to coerce them to take you back, no amount of trying to connect with them on an emotional level is going to work because they're still going to uh, really be holding on to that pain, that hurt, that frustration, that baggage, that history from what happened to you before. And you've got to really acknowledge that you hurt them in some way and acknowledge that you had an impact on them that was maybe less than desirable. So that is how to get your ex to uh, uh, forgive you. That is how to apologize to your ex. If you are watching this on our website, modernlove.life, go ahead and click on the link down below this video and that'll take you over to a page where you can learn more about how to really connect with your ex on an emotional level, how to put the past behind you, how to help them to let go of their uh, pain, their agony, their hurt feelings towards you so the two of you can start to move towards a new beginning together. If on the other hand you're watching this video on uh, YouTube, what you can do is you can go down below into the description and you will find a link that will take you to a website called Relationship Inner Game. There you can just tell us a little bit more about your breakup uh, through you know a simple painless 30 second little quiz and um, it will start to send you some tips, advice and strategies specifically uh, t tailored to what you've told us, okay? And uh, once again, if you're watching this on YouTube, please go ahead and give this video a like, go ahead and subscribe to this channel. And if you would please go ahead and leave a comment down below, letting me know what sorts of videos you would like to see me make in the future. Anyway, this has been Clay with modernlove.life. This has been Relationship Inner Game, and I'll talk to you in our next video. Please take care.